Good morning. It's first day, the 25th of April. Bitcoin update. This is Bitcoin on the daily. We bounce from green and as I explained earlier in the week, I'm looking for this as a 5 lakhs to the upside. Now doing uh, the correction and then continuation to the upside, which you can see here in my Elliott wave chart. So that we are now in lag number two. And when you look at it, I'm looking for this move. So we have one to here and make it a bit like this. Then we have an A, B. And for now, it seems to fit like we are doing here a five leg structure. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, which means one more to the downside. It's it's not a very pretty pattern, but it fits and it seems to me as most logical. And after that, we should uh, bounce and continue towards 80,000. If I go to my other chart, um, you can see that this lines up with what I already showed earlier in the week that we should see this move and then the bounce. When I go to the one hour, it explains it a bit more. One more down, take out this low, uh, grab the liquidity below here, st running the stops. And it should be also a move into the discount zone. This is your uh, impulsive move higher. And this would be a drop into the discount zone where we look for a bounce. On the shorter term, I am looking for this kind of move first and to possibly do a bit higher up first, more chop, take the liquidity over here and then make that fifth leg. But that's not really necessary. We could go down from here already. Um, right now, the current price action is saying, um, yeah, we are already going. I made this one based uh, earlier this morning based on this price action where I saw that as a possibility to the red box, stop hunt and down. But looking at the current price action, we may already be going for it now. And so this four, this is the one hour chart again. This four might be already in place here and that we do have this kind of move which should bring us uh, below 63,000. And after that, as it looks now, well, what I do think that we bounce and do this and go for 80,000. Because this is the impulsive move, one, two, and then three, four, five up. And still keeping in mind though, that we, didn't take this low so if this turns to be wrong this this if this expectation is wrong this would be my next target take uh, the liquidity at 59,000 and then look for continuation to the upside um, higher time frames I'm still bullish we are still missing one leg at least one leg to the upside here on the daily and that's why I am bullish for at least one more cycle to the upside. Um, and that could even happen after we take our, that liquidity at 59,000. But on lower time frames, I do see good chances. Now doing one more down, like here. 62,000 more or less, or lower 62, and then look for a bounce. Let's see tomorrow where we are.